Hello, it's another day. Good morning. Or whatever time it is in your time zone. Thank you for joining me today. Um, I'm going to talk about a... Um, there's an African saying, an African proverb that says, if you want to go fast, go alone. But if you want to go far, go together. Now, clearly <laughs> there are some things that, you know, we're on a journey on our own. <laughs> I'm not disputing that, right? Because you know, that's just obvious. But actually, in, as you know, human beings, we're social creatures. You know, any innovation, any success that has been achieved by anyone in the world through history at any one point in time, you know, they never did that on their own. Someone just let me cross. Um, they never did that on their own. They did it with the help and support of friends, family, loved ones, whoever, brother, sister, mother, whatever it is, right? You know, when we look at modern day times and the people who we deem as, you know, self-made, well, actually, uh, I, I get what people mean by self-made, but at the same time, no one is self-made. Um, you created a product, someone helped you create that product. Um, you created a product, someone bought that product. Plenty of people bought that product off you. So the investors in your business were your customers, were your clients. So anyway, community, right? That's just a general, simple, basic level of understanding about community, right? In terms of, you know, want to achieve it. But on a more, on a different level, um, you know, community keeps us going, community keeps us alive. The herd look after each other. You know, the stronger ones look after the weaker ones. Everyone's got a role in community. Now, you might not have one right now, but with technology, you know, it's possible to go out there and find your community, find your tribe, find the people that you vibe with. And I'm not saying there's a, you know, a one tribe fits all. You know, you might be part of multiple tribes. You know, I'm part of multiple tribes of uh, and communities where I get enriched, empowered, inspired by those different communities for different reasons, for different things. And so, you know, this desire that there might be one community that meets all our needs for me personally, that doesn't work. And... Um, you know, the saying about putting all your eggs in one basket, well, um, yeah, I, I just, you know, to think, if, even in relationships, right? So even in relationships where, you know, we might have a partner who we're aligned with on many, many things, but, um, you know, for me, I, I don't expect a partner to fulfill and meet, you know, every single need that I have, because some of those needs are going to be unique to me as an individual. And that partner, um, that might not be their thing. It doesn't mean it's a bad thing, it just means it might not be their thing. So, um, community, if you want to go fast, go alone. If you want to go far, go together. You know, where are the tribes that you could link with? Where are the people that look like you, sound like you, talk like you, are interested in the things that you do. Go out and find them. As much as, you know, I'm mindful of my use of technology, you know, in these past 10 years, that has allowed me to find like-minded tribes of all kinds of different people who, uh, um, you know, there's some alignment in our values, our principles, our purpose. So, yep. That's just the thought for today. I hope you have a great day, as best as you can. And yeah, said with love, said with respect. Take care, bless up, and one love. Peace.